everyone and thank you for watching Edupedia World videos. In this lecture, we will continue to talk about account assignment in Sales and Distribution module SAP ERP system. In our previous lecture, we begin to talk about account assignment configuration steps. We learned about how to create condition tables. We learned about how to define an access sequence. And we learned about how to maintain account termination types and assign the access sequence. And now we are ready for the next step. Set up the account termination procedure. The account termination procedure contains the list of condition types defined in the previous step. To set up an account termination procedure, go to transaction code SPRO, click on SAP reference IMG. Go to Sales and Distribution. Go to Basic Functions. Go to Account Assignment Casting. Revenue account termination. Define and assign account termination procedure. And double click on Define account termination procedure. Now you see standard SAP configuration procedure. The account termination procedure has condition types linked together in a schema. So standard SAP provides procedure KOFI00. When we select this procedure and Double click on Control Data from Dialog Structure section. We see two condition types for this procedure KOFI account termination and KOFK with account termination controlling. And we see Requirement routine assigned here. We can create our new procedure by pressing New Enters button. We can delete procedures using Delete button and we can copy as a reference by pressing Copy S button. After we create our new procedure, we just need to select it and double click on control data. And here, add new step, reference step, we can use new entries button or copy as reference button. Provide condition type, provide step number and counter, and if you need, provide requirement. After that, press Save button. And you will successfully define account termination procedure. Now press Back button. Next step in configuration account assignment is assigning the account termination procedure. 
In this step, you assign the account termination procedure to a billing document types. To assign the account termination procedure, follow IMG Press, Sales and Distribution, Basic Functions, Account Assignment Casting, Revenue Account Termination, Double click on Define and Assign Account Determination Procedures. And double click on Assign Account Determination Procedure. You can select the billing document. After that, attach the appropriate account termination procedure and this settings ensures that when the billing document is created, the account termination will be down following this procedure. Similarly, assign a procedure to all other billing documents that you need. And you see here one more column. CAAC here enables you to specify a cash allocation key. With this, the system posts a to a general ledger account for cash rather than for a receivables account. So, one more thing you don't need to add here billing types because automatically system copies here all billing types and if the billing documents without a condemnation procedure this field will be just blank like in this step after providing all necessary changes here just press save button as usual after that go back to SAP Easy Access screen. Next step in configuration is to define and assign an account key. Account keys are used to group together similar accounts in financial accounting. You can also use an account key to point to a specific account number in account termination. For example, the account key ERL is used to point to a revenue account. In the pricing procedure, you will assign this key to the pricing conditions related to, to the product price. To define an account key, go to Transaction code SPRO. Click on SCP reference IMG. Go to Sales and Distribution. Basic functions. Account assignment casting, revenue account determination, and double click on define and assign account keys. And double click on define account key. Now you see here some standard account keys offered by SAP, such as ERL, Sales Revenues, ERF, 
create revenues and ERS such as sales deductions or discounts. You can add a new account by specifying a three character identifier after pressing new entries button. We will create account key ZTT and name will be test account key. After that, you can save these changes. As usual, if you want to delete some account keys, press on delete button. You can copy as a reference some field, just select necessary field and press on copy as a reference. If you want to find your account key, press position button and our account key ZPT. And we see our account key ZTT test account key. Now press back button, and the next task is to assign the account key. As usual, follow IMG price, sales and distribution, basic functions. Account assignment casting, revenue account termination, and double click on define and assign account keys. After that, double click on assign account keys. And here you see your pricing procedure steps of the pricing procedure, control column, condition types list, and account keys. You can specify an account key for each condition type. By pressing new entries button, you can define new account key for your condition type. And you can change some condition types here. If you want to delete some entries, you can select entry and press delete button. You can as usual use copy as a reference button. After making here all necessary changes, you can save your changes. After that, go back to the main screen and you have successfully defined and assigned account keys Rise it to your determination procedure. And now you're ready for the last step. And our final step will be assign general ledger accounts. In the final step, we specify the actual account numbers for each combination key. To configure this, as usual, go to Configuration Transaction S P R O. Click on SAP Reference IMG. Go to Sales and Distribution. Go to basic functions
go to account assignment casting go to revenue account determination and double click on assign general ledger accounts now you see the screen that displays all the condition tables with the key combinations you can sort this list in ascending order you can sort this list in descending order you can set some filters here you can delete some filters you can make a total, you can make subtotal you can expand tree and collapse tree you can send this list to the Excel file and you can change layout here now select the table for which you want to maintain the account numbers and set up condition records for example select table 1 customer groups material group and account key double click on it and on the screen you can specify general ledger account for your key combination of fields Just find your general ledger account and double click on it, just for example. After that, press, press save button as usual and go back to the SAP Easy Access screen. So we have successfully complete all necessary steps for account assignment configuration. We create condition tables, we define an access sequence, we maintain account determination types and assign the access sequence, we set up the account determination procedure, we assign the account determination procedure, we define and assign an account key, and in our final step we assign General Ledger Accounts. Thank you for watching Upedia World Videos.